Hey Internet, how's it going? Welcome to another episode of the John Graves Show. Apparently, Ed Boon teases four more DLC characters for Mortal Kombat X, and honestly, you know, we already knew that this was going to happen. Honestly, if somebody out there, man, if they thought that this wasn't going to happen, yeah, it's going to happen, because Ed Boon, he actually tweeted out um, some um, a, a picture of some silhouetted characters, and with the whole thing of who's next. And... I can pretty much go ahead and, or at least with with me looking at this right now, I don't think that these are any characters who are actually in the story mode. I think that these are, I think that these are just brand new characters who that they're just trying to like model in and throw and throw and throw into the game. I mean, honestly, they could probably throw Rain in there, maybe Sindel. Um, say Tanya's already in the game, so. Hmm. I mean, like, Sin Sindel, Baraka's dead, so that's done. And Rain, those are, like, the only two characters in which they probably could throw in there and do that. However, for me personally, it's like, actually, I don't really know why they don't make a story add-on. I don't really get, I, I don't know why they don't do that. I mean, like, don't get me wrong, I mean, like, it would probably take up a lot of fucking time, but hey, you know, I mean, like, who wouldn't buy that to have way more story for this game that is supposed to have way more story and way more fucking modes in it? I mean, like, if they can patch that in there instead of giving us, man, like, brand new characters. Also, the question is, are these brand new characters? Are these older characters? And, of course, it's four of them, and I assume that one of them is Cyrax, or at least it could be Cyrax. But then again, thinking back to like the Mortal Kombat days, it's a good chance that these characters that they that they probably took some of the characters from fucking Deadly Alliance and then they're trying to like put them into this shit. Because honestly, Deadly Alliance is actually the next stage 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 in the Mortal Kombat story. So it's a good chance that man we actually may get Su Hao or fucking <laughs> Or fucking Movado. It's a good chance that we may get those motherfuckers back. And honestly, I'm not really trying, man, to shit on them. But honestly, I think that if they act... Well, they really gotta fix Su Hao's, like, act... Uh, they, they, like, if he comes back, they really gotta fix his... They gotta fix that fucking design of his. But Movado or Cobra or Kira... Yeah, yeah, Cobra or Kira, if, like, if they came back, like, they would be pretty cool... To actually sort of see them come back and then actually done right. Now that would be pretty nice. But I'm trying to think. Think from the Mortal Kombat 5 universe. Which is supposed to come from around the Mortal Kombat 4 universe. The only characters who that I can think who pretty much can come in around this time. Is Jarek, Reiko, Kai, and um, hmm, somebody else. Oh yeah, they could probably. Oh yeah, they can finally probably throw in new um uh, new the uh, cybot because just to quiet people down. One of the silhouettes he does seem to be wearing a helmet. So it's so so if anything, if I can go from like a Mortal Kombat four cast stand standpoint, and Tanya's already in the game, and I already know for a fucking fact that they're not making Fujin a fucking playable character because they just don't want to do that shit. And if they do, please thank you for doing that because you know. Show Fujin some love. He's only been he's cameoed in way more games than like than like he's actually been fucking playable in. He was only playable in Mortal Kombat 4. But honestly, if they were meant to add in four brand new characters and they were all from Mortal Kombat 4, I would honestly give it to Jarek, Kai, Reiko, and Fujin or Noob Cybot. Because those are the ones who were who were from 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 around that game, and that's when this game it takes place in the storyline. However, I don't necessarily think think that they're really going to go ahead and try and um try and pull in characters from the next Mortal Kombat game until they kinda get until they hit that point with with Mortal Kombat eleven. But but that is what I gotta say about that. Please tell me what do you think about this down there in the comment section. Catch you guys on the next John Grave show. Please keep watching anime, keep playing video games. I'm out.